Hey now, Damez is back in the house. I got a cool video for you today. Some of you probably can make some use out of this. Uh, Damez is going to learn you how to make your own cheats in the ZS NES emulator for the computer. So, first we'll start it. Obviously, you can search the internet, game facts, whatever, and get lots of cheat codes there. But maybe you're playing a game, maybe it's an obscure game. You can't find the cheats for it. So you can make your own. Here's what you do. I showed this game. It's a good example because it doesn't have a, a number for your life total. If you see at the bar, you, at, at the top of the screen, you got a red bar. So you can't just search for the number that represents your life. You have to find it some other way. So we'll do this. Comparative search. Cheat. Click on search. Enter the value. going to search, which searches everything. I think I hit the wrong button. Hang on. Here we go. Search. Restart. We need to do this one here. Comparative search. That was my mistake. Comparative search. One byte, yes. Uh, most things you want to change will be in the first byte. What, 0 to 55. If you, need, if you need higher for some reason, increase the number of bytes to the number that you want to search for there. I'm going to assume his life is between 0 and 255, because it probably is. Even though it's a bar, it's represented by a number in the program code. So we're going to search now. All right. View. It finds everything. So that's that's step one. Now we want to go into back into the game and, and lose some life. That way the number has decreased. There we go. So now I'll do go in there again. We can, we're going to search again. The new number is... See, that's greater than old value? No, the new number now is less than old value. So I will search for that. And that'll lower the number of results. Now there's 86 bits of information in the uh, 86 bytes of the program code that have reduced since the last time. So we have to do it again. So let's exit out of this. Lose some life again. Now it's reduced again. So of those 86, which one of those is now smaller than, click, the old value? Search. 28 of them. Okay, leave the game, do it again. Search. Smaller than 28 again. Hmm. Let's try it again. All right. F only three of them are. Okay. I'll try it again. The more time you do it, the better it is. Still three values. Search again. Smaller again. Okay. It's down to those three. All right. Now let's see if we can increase it. It knows of those three, so let's die. Now I'm going to say it's increased. The next man starts, now the value will be higher. So that should narrow it right down, now that it's full. It's still comparing with all the rest, so the new value now is greater. Hopefully this will narrow it down. Nope, down to those three. Okay, we're going to view. Now let's try. Seven, 171 is this value. Hmm. So, uh... It's probably one of these two, 64. I don't think they give him 171 health. So one of these two is probably it. Possibly both, but probably one of them. So let's add a code based on this first line here. Enter the value. 64, let's enter 60. All right. 60. The new value. Enter cheat description. First, cheat. Add the code. There we go. Save. We'll save the code. Auto load here the cheat file. We'll auto load this cheat right away next time. So, uh, yeah, let's see if it worked. There it did. You see my HP bar at the top? It's gone down some. Because it's 60 instead of 64. And. Every time I get hurt, it goes down, but then the, the cheat kicks in and says, no, no, it's 60, it's not 54 or whatever. So it's, it essentially means infinite HP. Now, I'd rather make it look clean and have a full bar, so what I'm going to do is add another code. Whoops. That's the wrong one. Search. View. Add this one again. We'll make it 64. We'll call it second cheat. I know it's the fixed one. 
add that remove the first cheat because that's 60 we don't like that boom second cheat save we'll save it as a cheat file it'll auto load next time we load the game so this is full HP and total invincibility cool hey we know how to make our own Super Nintendo cheats this method only works of course with you know values like lives and things like that quantities of things maybe you want uh, 99 spoon daggers in Final Fantasy 2 that'd be fucking pimp right you know what I'm saying <laughs> alright later motherfuckers